Hi, dear friends. Welcome to another episode of ABC Useful Tips. In this video, we're going to show you simple ways of how to remove background of pictures like this into a transparent picture or a picture that's supposed to be transparent but it can remove the back, white background into a picture that even the space around the handles, in the handles, right, are transparent. Alright, stay tuned and we'll show you step by step how to do uh, this, alright, using PowerPoint. If you'd like to be the first to be notified of any future videos uploaded or any other videos regarding useful tips on IT for Education, in the future we will also be uploading another video of how to create a simple pictorial task okay, for students to do, right, that can actually have uh, links and their uh, to other videos or other tasks that you want them to do, right? Okay, and I also using the uh, the transparent pictures you have created. Please click the subscribe button or click these words to subscribe, right? And we will dive right in. Step one, it's very simple. Just get ready all the pictures that you would like to remove the backgrounds, all right? That you'll be using. Okay. Second. Open up a blank um, file on a PowerPoint. Using PowerPoint, you can easily remove the background of any picture that you want, right? So let's just show you straight away. Okay, so what you do is, when in this blank page of the PowerPoint, what you can do is click, uh, highlight um, the any other boxes that you do not wish. It's just a totally blank page. Okay, and then go to your um, folder that you have saved the files. Okay, and then what you do is you just have to click, hold, and copy over to that blank page and release. Okay, the picture will be on the blank page itself of the PowerPoint. Okay, next you will show you will see that on the panel, okay, that will have this uh, icon here called remove background. Okay, once you have uh, copy over the, the picture, you just have to click on remove background. You see the background is removed. Whatever is shown in purple is actually uh without the background okay cool so if you want to keep some of the items that were automatically uh, removed from the background what you can do is just click on the item again double click and you will see remove background again okay click on it okay this time around just make sure that this area uh, mark areas to keep is uh, automatically clicked and when you move the cursor to the picture you will see a pencil okay, that means you can select items to keep Okay, let me show you one more time. All right, how to get this pencil out again? So this has to be gray. Okay, just show you again. If uh, if it's not gray, it'll be all white. So you just click on uh, mark areas to keep. Bring the cursor to the uh, picture with the pencil. So now, if I want to uh, retain the outer circle, okay, what I need to do is just to click on any space within outer circle. If it works, it will show. So this show that it doesn't work, otherwise it will turn the original color. So what I do is I'll just click in the space and hold it until somewhere within the space still and then let go. Okay, so within this, uh, the, the straight line that is drawn, it will actually uh, change it to the original. Okay, so I'll continue doing that. And I keep on doing until the final part is um, turned into original color and that's it keep the changes you can see that okay I have now uh, background removed and set the target board including the last uh, outer circle that's it in fact not all pictures you need to uh, have such a tedious process of uh, having to uh, highlight the places that you want okay so um, most of the time it's pretty simple okay so let's say for example i convert another one remove another background okay i bring this over okay now you can see that this one although it's supposed to be a uh, transparent right but uh, the background is still there so i just want to uh, remove the background okay total so i click on the picture and click on remove background on the top left hand corner Okay, you can see that most of the background has been removed and set the small little space behind the handles. Okay. 
So mark areas to remove this time. Okay, mark areas to remove. Alright. Okay, then the pencil uh, appears in the picture. Click on this area. Click and drag a little, All right? And the two areas behind the handles have been moved. Okay, so let's double check. Okay, cool. So I just move it back to the uh, target board. You can see that it is transparent now. All right, that's right. So we have gotten two pictures that are uh, backgrounds removed. If you'd like to be the first to be notified of future videos regarding useful tips, in fact, there's another video that will be uh, uploaded. Okay, on the second method of simple way to remove background, okay, of pictures, yeah, please click subscribe at this um, at the bottom or click this circle to subscribe. All right. So at the moment, have fun and stay safe. Take care.